In 1982, the Soviet spacecraft Venera 13 did the unthinkable. It landed on Venus, a planet so hostile it could crush a submarine, melt lead and rain sulfuric acid from its yellow skies. Yet, Venera 13 survived for 127 minutes, transmitting eerie images and critical data until Venus destroyed it. Now imagine you standing there. How long would a human survive on Venus, or on any planet for that matter? This is your planetary survival challenge. Let's begin with the worst. Venus. The moment you arrive unprotected, you're crushed instantly by the pressure. 90 times that of Earth. Even in a Venus-proof suit, the 470 degrees Celsius heat, acid clouds and CO2-dense atmosphere overwhelm you. Cooling systems fail, heat stroke hits, your suit collapses, time survived, 20 minutes. Mercury, it has no atmosphere, which means extremes. Land on the dark side and you'll freeze at minus 173 degrees Celsius. Land on the sunlit side and you'll burn at over 477 degrees Celsius. Even with radiation protection, you'll last only 15 minutes before the temperature and solar radiation destroy your systems. Mars, you step onto rusty red soil under a pale orange sky. It's a Martian summer day, just 20 degrees Celsius at the equator. Sounds survivable? Almost. The atmosphere is toxic, the radiation is 20 times Earth's, and by nightfall it drops to minus 70 degrees Celsius. After 10 hours, your oxygen runs out. But you lived long enough to imagine staying. Jupiter. A gas giant with no surface, just endless layers of ammonia, hydrogen, crushing pressure and radiation. The Galileo probe lasted 58 minutes. You, you'd pass through hurricane winds and die from g-forces after just three minutes. Europa, one of Jupiter's moons, frozen, cracked and hiding a liquid ocean under its icy crust. The radiation from Jupiter disables your oxygen system within minutes. You collapse onto the ice. Time survived 15 minutes. Saturn, another gas giant, another descent into chaos. Winds exceed 1,300 feet per second. Ammonia storms and minus 200 degrees Celsius temperatures freeze and crush your suit. You manage five minutes before everything fails. Now this is different. Titan has a thick atmosphere and lakes of methane. It's minus 180 degrees Celsius, but your suit holds. You walk on solid ground. There's radiation, but less than Jupiter. You explore for two and a half hours before hypothermia sets in. Uranus, a frozen gas giant colder than Saturn, winds howl at 900 kilometers per hour. You fall through ice cold clouds and die in under four minutes. Neptune, it looks calm, but don't be fooled. Winds reach 1300 miles per hour. Temperatures, minus 220 degrees Celsius. You're gone in two minutes. Pluto, small, dark and distant. Surface temperatures are minus 240 degrees Celsius. The sun is just a star in the sky. Your suit becomes brittle, cracks and fails. Time survived, eight minutes. So, could we ever live on another world? Elon Musk thinks we'll land on Mars by 2029 with colonies by 2050. Plans for Mars cities are underway from 3D printed habitats to hydroponic farms. But the truth, Every planet wants to kill you, in its own unique way.